Hello, and it's time for another fountain pen doodle. I recently got a haircut, and it got really hot out today. Because last night I had to go to bed with a fan on beside me, but I have a hard time falling asleep if there's a lot of sounds in the room, or if there's any light. I know some people like the sound of having their TV on, which I find kind of strange in a way, but I guess it helps them fall asleep. But for me, if I have any sounds in the room, or if there's... a pretty much a clock ticking in the same house, I can't fall asleep, or if there's any light anywhere whatsoever. I mean, I do have a night light in my main room where I do all of my video editing and everything like that, and have it set up there so that when I plug in things, um, when it's dark in the room, I can see where I'm plugging in the outlet. But sometimes that light, if like when I have my door open, the light shines through that, and into my bedroom and it keeps me awake and then I can't fall asleep but I had the fan on and it kept me up for maybe an extra half hour but it was so hot in my bedroom that if I didn't have it I'd never fall asleep but I did get a haircut and that's kept me a bit cooler and it's easier to get ready and go places I don't have to worry about looking like I never take care of my hair or something and yeah, and I'm not cooler now, not to worry about being so sweaty and everything. And where I live is an upstairs apartment. It's kind of difficult to keep it cool in here. I have, have this one spot where my spiral steps, when you walk up them, it's this big open area down there. And what I'm wanting to do is I'm thinking about putting up some like big curtains there so that any of the cold air that's in this room won't go down and to where the steps are because right now I'm pretty much trying to cool my entire apartment plus that whole area there but the area where the steps is at there's a huge amount of space it's pretty much like a whole extra room and yeah th I think I need to get a second air conditioner probably that would probably help I think I'll take the one that I have put that one in my bedroom and then buy a larger air conditioner and use that for the main room I'm in right now. And that should help keep my computer cooler because I, I don't want to do really heavy video editing if it's really hot in the room. Um, well, number one, first of all, it takes um, a lot of processing power for some of the video editing that I do. And I don't want my computer to overheat. And second of all, it's pretty hard to concentrate when it's really hot in the room and all I'm thinking about is trying to get a nice drink of cold water or just just relax but things are going good I'm getting to where I'm getting most of this sketchbook filled in I think I'm about I wouldn't say quite halfway but I am about 40% done with the sketchbook so we're getting there and once I'm done with the sketchbook I will show everybody a sketchbook flip through and we can take a look at all the drawings and I'll talk about them Thanks for watching and you have a good day.